Donald Trump's son-in-law, uh, Jared Kushner. Kush, okay, interesting. Chasing a multi-million dollar deal with Chinese, with the Chinese. Uh, so what is the what is the problem with this, right? He's just trying to fatten up his pockets, right? I mean, he's in the Trump family right now, I guess. Here's the problem. He is advising the president on foreign policy. So what is the term for that? It's called conflict of interests. Okay, so Rosters point of this, they say Donald Trump's son-in-law is currently in negotiations with a massive Chinese financial conglomerate to redevelop one of his family's crown jewel properties, while at the same time he's advising the president-elect on foreign policy and setting up his administration, the New York Times is reporting. Um, according to the report, the Kushner family began negotiations with the Chinese financiers uh, financiers well before Trump was elected president, with talks centering on the Kushner's family property at 666 Fifth Avenue. Keeping it classy. Uh, the building is part of Kushner real estate empire that has made over $7 billion in acquisitions in the last decade, often using offshore money. So much for uh, trying to keep everything in the U.S., right? Uh, while Trump's closeness to his businesses remains problematic, with the president-elect continuously de delaying details on how he will establish a blind trust to avoid conflict of interest charges, Kushner's involvement with both the president and his own family's business presence presents a whole different set of problems. What do I think about this? Because we just reported on the story of the GOP uh, trying to gut the ethics committee because... They don't want to be watched on their fucking ethics because there's massive conflict of interest all over the fucking Trump administration. And I hope that it will get to a point where the evidence is just so overwhelming that he will somehow get impeached. I know it's unlikely. I know it'd still be Pence, but you guys get the point, okay? The... <laughs> this administration is going to be one of the dirtiest administrations ever. I don't know if it's going to be as dirty as the Cheney Bush administration in terms of literally going to Middle Eastern wars to get profits, but for this administration, I mean, it's going to be close to, if not just as close. I mean, I think Bush's Bush's cabinet was uh, was the richest until now, which now I think it's going to be the richest. I know it's going to be the richest now, but I think Bush is the second richest, so... We need to make sure we make sure there's no conflict of interest here because if so, not only is Trump already fucking the American people, he's going to fuck them to no end.